Good things happen to those who wait. Of course, Alabama's Mac Jones is an example of that. The redshirt junior quarterback first arrived on campus back in 2017. He was buried in the depth chart between Jalen Hurts, Tua Tungavailoa, and battled for reps with three other players. All he needed was an opportunity, just a shot. While Hurts transferred, Tua, of course, went to the NFL, Jones had an open door, and he ran through it. He's now one of the top passers in the game, leading his team to the college football semifinal. Tom Rinaldi sat down with Jones ahead of the Rose Bowl. If you get recruited by Alabama to play quarterback, you got some ability. Mac, from the outside, what do you think the perception was of going to a school that already had Jalen, a record-setting freshman, and in the same class with Tua? A lot of people will probably call me crazy. <laughs> At the same time, I just wanted to come in and develop myself to where I could help out our team. I knew, obviously, they were there, but at the same time, I was like, at some point, I'm going to get a chance. So I stuck with it, and obviously, you know, I learned a lot from those two, and it's just a blessing to learn from them and then come in with them and, and compete with them every day. How would you describe the patience it's taken from your arrival to scout team to where you are? Obviously, there was a lot of days where my patience was tested. Coming in as a freshman, if you're not playing or things are not going your way, but you kind of just have to take it day by day and don't look at where you're at. And Coach Saban always would say, like, even though I was still third string, it was like, we have a rep chart, not a depth chart. Mac Jones wants it all. Long ball, man, there, touchdown. How would you describe your season, Mac? It's been wild. <laughs> um, I don't ever like talking about myself, so I mean, really just proud of my team, honestly, because probably nobody will ever play 11 SEC games in a row again, and we kind of set it as a goal to win all those games, and we did it. Each team, you know, presented a different challenge, but we never, we never really blinked. You looking at a champ, hey, all I do is win. All I do is win. For everything you went through, what has manifested most? to allow this absolutely sensational performance to this point this season. You know, it was just a great opportunity. I mean, it's all that hard work that you put in as a team, as a person, and it just adds up. And then, you know, you get to play the 11 games that we played, but at the same time, it's like, all right, we're right there. So just win the games, and that's what we've done. And obviously, we have, we're close to the finish, and you know, the team that we're about to play is a great football team and we're just really focused on that, just kind of keep it how we've always kept it. Looking at a champ, hey, all I do is win. Yep, you just gotta wait your turn and shine. Jones has been a pivotal part of the Crimson Tide's success in his first full season as starter. The redshirt junior leads the nation in total QBR, completion percentage, as well as yards per attempt. And he could be the third Alabama player to, and the first Bama quarterback, by the way, to win the Heisman, which is a crazy stat when I read it. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.